After suffering their fourth loss in a row and their third straight by a combined 83 points, which is more than any three game losing streak during the playoff drought, it seems that Sean McDermott's process has sucked the swagger out of the locker room. We're not going to be confident until we can find a way to win, said Lorenzo Alexander, and 2-7 and seven is not what anybody expected. I mean, we're just not playing up to a, a good enough standard right now and uh, just inconsistent um, as a team right now. You know, defense plays well, and then the offense, we're not, we're not doing well. I mean, it's just inconsistent, so we got to be able to play better as a team, as a unit, if we want to find ourselves in, in a position to win a game, and that's kind of what we're fighting for right now. It was like a domino effect today, you know, it just kept stacking up on us. Uh, we really couldn't catch back up with it. Um, good thing, I guess we got one more game coming up next week, and we'll try to come up with that win before the bye. There's no other way, you know. To, to get out of it, you know, so we gotta we gotta go through it, man. We gotta stay together as a team, um, not point fingers, stay positive, uh, which is hard. I know it's gonna be hard, but at the same time, that's what we have to do. That is frustrating. Um, just not putting things together. Together, we had turnovers, um, some force, some. Uh, it's just hard right now, you know. Um, I don't know really what to tell you right now at this point. It's just frustrating. Over the last three games, LaShawn McCoy has rushed for 24 yards on 24 carries. He did not address the media after the game. He left the locker room before reporters were allowed in. With the Bills Report at New Era Field, I'm Dan Fates.